Delta State Commission and for Information, Mr. Charles Aniago, who recently recovered from COVID-19, briefed journalists at Government House Asaba about the Executive Council visual meeting presided over by the State Governor, Dr. Ifai Okowa. The commissioner said that some of the measures to curtail the spread of the coronavirus include establishment of mobile courts to try the falters and introduction of new COVID-19 guidelines to curtail the spread of the virus in the state. That we are coming out a number of um, other strategies aimed at um, strictly combating the virus. One of such strategies is that uh, we are going to now take very, very critical advantage of uh, community bodies like uh, community associations. The local government chairmen are going to be saddled with much more responsibility to pilot the affairs of uh, driving the protocols at the local government level. We will not only be talking to people via the regular uh, medium of mass communication, we will also take advantage of certain orthodox means of um, reaching out to the people, even if it means having to talk to traditional rulers, which we have also uh, seen as a veritable source of reaching out to our people. Those we are going to take advantage of in the course of uh, the new regime we are putting in place with a view to reaching out to our people where they live in the villages. Aniago asserted that COVID-19 is not a death sentence and urged Delta State residents to freely go for screening for the virus. He said members of the first family of the state are doing well and convey their appreciations to all Deltans for their prayers and show of love. It's just that it's not that easy and quite affordable to just begin to just test everybody day by day. But when you take this step, it becomes proper. Don't just say because you are not feeling any symptom. It's free. The moment you know your status, it also guides you. From Asaba, Austin as reporting.